And then it's off to Nassau in the Bahamas, and the Hawks control the opening tip. Posting marble inside, turn, shoot, scores. I think really mixing up his game, you know, uh, both with threes and drives and pull-ups and post-ups. And that's, you know, the, re the reason we moved him to back to the two spot is to get him all over the floor with the ball. I think that's where he's at his best. I felt like it was supposed to happen. You know, I, I work on my shot every day. Um, I shoot well in practice, so it was it was only a matter of time before I could. I just need to start getting into a rhythm, you know, before we head to the Bahamas and, and we playing against a uh, top tier um, competition. So I put the work in, so I'm not, I'm not uh, you know, what I'm saying super crazy about the results. I, I knew they were going to start to happen, so I just got to be consistent, um, try and get into a rhythm early, get easy buckets early. I got an easy layup, um, which I think also opened up the size of the basket for me. So, you know, just getting, I think, easy buckets and transition and, and getting into the floor of the game will always help you with your uh, perimeter shot. Backs the dribble in on his man, drives off the glass, scores, and a foul call. What an All-American move that time by Dev uh, Marble as he lost Ladani. Pete got it going there. Uh, Mike was a little bit off. I wanted I, I wanted him to get a dig. He, he bangs a three. I thought Utah it was solid again. And the Woodbury comes back in the game and does some pretty good things. I mean, he's been terrific, I think. And, and I just think that's what I wanted to get out of those last 16 minutes. My confidence has always been there. It's just um, about my feet. I talked to my, my guardian, told me that I just got to work on my feet. I don't square my feet when I shoot. So that's what I've been working on all week. And I think that's what helped me a lot today. We got a lot of shot makers on our team. So getting reps uh, on the offensive end is kind of difficult at times. So I'm just trying to find my spots and uh, just play a uh, good defensive game because that's what we really need out of me. And uh, my offense is going to come. Marble to Woodbury. Shot fake. Woody drives around his man all the way to the basket. Scores off glass. That's what you were talking about in the pregame show. Uh, Finishing like hard. Finish strong when you get to the rim. Take it as far in as you can. Don't. Well, I think as the season goes on, the more comfortable they get out there, uh, you know, not only in terms of getting minutes in front of a crowd and having to make plays and make shots, it's knowing where to line up when we're running our stuff. If we're in a zone offense or a, or a press, where do I go? Where are they? You know, how do I react? If they got four guys up and one guy back, do I come up? Do I go back? Those types of things, you don't, you don't figure that out unless you're out there. You know, we try to get our guys to be students of the game on the bench, and, and you know, to a large degree they are, but there's nothing like being out there. You know, the bottom line is you just got to make sure you take care of business and, and move the ball, and, and that's, I think, the thing that was most impressive to me. And the final score will be 103-41. Hawks, very impressive top to bottom today, both ends of the floor. 103 -40.